I have a feeling the next series of episodes is going to be a little bit depressing in a funny way because as you guys can all relate, unless you're still in high school or college, once you graduate, life is fucking depressing. You saw a little bit, just a glimpse of what working in society looks like. You and a Megami just getting beat by those potatoes. Bro, shit is depressing, but we're eventually going to make it to Axel, meet Kazuma and the gang, and then Konosuba starts. So let's begin today's reaction. Where did she go? Ark? Water and hot springs. Isn't this the place that we came for the vacation in season two at the end? This is um the town where they worship uh the Axis, right? Okay. Already getting scammed in the background. That's right. Welcome to life. You gotta pay for rent, and you work your fucking nine to five, and then you come home, and maybe you can rest for a bit, and you gotta go to bed, and then repeat that shit again, so you can pay rent and eat food. What a shitty life. Yeah, she might just have to do random, just normie job like this. <laughs> what I say, guys? I I thought that shit's gonna get depressing. <laughs> Already fired? You are a child. Isn't she still like 13 or 14 at this current timeline? And her chest. <laughs> Oh, and then she started fighting the customers. Okay, that's a little bit of a no-no. Okay, you're fired. I'm so Wait, in the season two, near the end, when we were in this arc, was Megumi saying any references that would have implied that she was here before, like right now? Because I'm going to assume she might... <laughs> this, it's the best part. I'm going to assume that she starts working, handing out those pamphlets, maybe. Sounds like Yunyun, kind of. But it's not her, right? She's not already here. Close. Close. Huh? That hoodie... Okay, I was like, Eris? Never mind. Look at the pretty mug. <laughs> judging by their looks, judging by her look, she might be gaslighting them. I don't know. I feel like she's, she's gaslighting them. Okay. No, 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 hold up! Maybe she's the bad one. Nah, you're getting played, Megumi. Megumi, you got played. <laughs> she runs fast. What did she do? Did she like... Okay. <laughs> no, Eris! He's got a third eye now. Hey. We should team up with her. Maybe she can get us food. It looks like she's like kind of like struggling to survive too. Huh? Oh, who is this? Hey, we didn't see any of these girls in um uh, in season two. Dude, that girl is a menace. Absolute menace. We need a true proponent of gender equality right now so that nobody just like listens to the girl immediately without hearing both sides. We need Kazuma here. Steal the pantsu! I, I don't know. This is weird because I thought we were saving her and now she's saving us. Like, what the fuck? Maybe she's gonna frame it in this way so that you owe me now, right? Maybe? Lolicious. That's a word that I didn't know existed. <laughs> Our order has been blessed with a lolly, bro. They're all lollycons. I would have expected. I don't know. It's like a cult. It's like a church, some kind of holy place, right? I would have expected them to be like, I don't not be lollycons. They gotta be some kind of holy beings, but no, they're a bunch of degenerates. Yeah, they should be forbidden. <laughs> Stay away from the kids. Hmm. I don't like the soundtrack. The soundtrack is so crazy sounding. Cause like, Zesta, he's quite older in the season two, wasn't he? But um, this soundtrack, man, it sounds kind of uplifting and positive, but there's also a part where it just like creeps you out. You know what I mean? Especially with the other people trying to make you sign up for the access cult. It's really a cultish music. Mm. Careful now, careful now. Hey, 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 hey. Hmm? <laughs> you fucking daddy! <laughs> hey, 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 hey. That's like four different requests, bro. This, this. <laughs> 
No. You guys need to get fucking smited. Like, y'all need... Y'all need Jesus. Megumi got a marketing idea. Oh? Okay, Megumi. Okay. Oh, no. Somebody come help pick the apple up. Okay. Did she? Look at the way Megumi is strategizing how to get people to sign up. Did she start the fucking meta? Because you saw in season 2 how everyone was so crafty in their way to like get people to sign up. They weren't doing this so far in this current season. But I feel like Megumi introducing Zesta to this just developed the meta of scamming people. So all of season 2 was Megumi's fault. <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> Bro, wisdom of the crimson demons is just fucking. What's it? Not is this like mul it's pyramid scheme, multi-level marketing, all of the above? There we go. Boing, 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 <laughs> boing. What the fuck, cameraman? <laughs> Spell the apples. Oh! <laughs> His voice is pretty funny. Bro. <laughs> Bro, relax! <laughs> His voice is so desperate. What's with that green flash at the end? And I thought Megumi was supposed to be the one running and falling. You're too creepy. Bro, you got so horny over the tits and you, you ruined the plan. <laughs> I love the fact that his voice just returns to normal, like distinguished, a uh, leader of this chapter. Oh, distraction! Yeah, you can. Bro, every Konosuba started with you getting bribed by food, right? She only joined the party because Kazuma like offered food, right? Oh, it's uh the pink lady, Lady Wolbach. Well, that's the thing. Voluptuous woman. Very voluptuous, but she... Really? No, he's capping. No way he knows her. Then again, you guys did tell me in season two that um Lady Wolbach and Hans was in the like uh in the same hot spring as Kazuma was at the end, right? So like, but that's that's in the future. This is the past. How does, how does this work? Megumin-san is trying to guilt trip us? Are, are you really putting all this failure on her right now? <laughs> this guy, the way he talks, he's a master scammer too. I mean, that's the entire point of Axe's cult. Look at this. They're very, they're very street smart. Oh, we're gonna scam her instead, not the jacked guy? Okay. Union! That's Union! Union's already here? We're gonna reunite? Union's gonna be like, Megami, what's happened to you? Ever since you left? You have to do this to make a living? Chumusuke! Hello. We're trying to make a living here. <laughs> Life is hard, Union. We're not coming from generational wealth like you. Guilty. Shame. <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Why are you rolling us in the middle of the street? <laughs> I didn't expect Union to show up so quick. Last episode was like a heartfelt departure. I'm like, oh, bye Union. I guess we won't see you until like Konosuba season two, but nah. They already met. We get them to sign up for the pamphlet. You're following us, aren't you? Yeah, well... Are you sure you didn't miss her? Nah, you missed her way more, right? I don't think Chomsky really gives a shit. <laughs> Is she? Chomsky is like, what's up? Ah, oh, it's Yun Yun. Yun Yun missed her so much. Self proclaimed rival. Best friend. He is her mentor? What, what is he? Scam artist? 
Together, I... He's a big bro or daddy. <laughs> Recruit or scam? Hey, times are tough. We gotta do whatever we can. Uh-oh. It's the cult music again. Yeah, we should get the fuck out of here. This place scares me. Nah, we're good. We're good. Oh? Holy... Oh. Sorry, sorry. I thought that's what who they were. Who are these guys? The cops? Well, we were out trying to fraud people. Like, I think he deserves this probably. <laughs> Scam people? Fucking money laundering? <laughs> Maybe even child trafficking, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't believe it, man. Playing with yourself? Dude, don't tell them all this <laughs> I bet she already knows all this and there's more. Hey, are you trying to help him right now? Guys, are you, are you trying to help him or put him in jail forever? Let's walk away, yeah. Bye. Uh-uh, uh-uh, we're out of here. Therese? Against? Who's the ruling figure here? Is there a king in this place? Oh. Hmm. Servant of the devil. He's a servant? Came from the demon? Why would the crimson demons know this shit? Are you just gonna believe this shit? What if Arui wrote this shit randomly? Cause edgy story. Me? He does have a connect. Oh my, what the fuck? What? Okay, he's just offended. He's very offended. But it kind of looks like he's trying to like grab her tits. I don't know, like, like I, don't, I don't know the way he's like, look at the, look. <laughs> Bro! At any, he's getting interrogated right now. And he's taking his shot. Bro, he always takes his shot. But maybe he's innocent. Uh, I, I don't know. He's probably... He is a dumbass, but... I don't necessarily think he's evil. A random letter from the Crimson Demon Village. Can we just trust it? I don't know. Inyun, did you make some shit up? Toketo. Toketo's prophecy? In danger? In like two seasons? In like in season two, maybe? In the future? Well, I don't know who's in the right here. I, I, Zesta is, you know, I don't know, man. <laughs> Father Zesta is, uh, is a bit of a character. He's still trying to fucking sexually harass the girl, even when he's trying to eat. He's getting arrested, and he's still going for it. This guy has no shame, but is he really in the wrong? I don't think so. I think there's a little bit of a misunderstanding here. Now, it's really nice that Union is already back, but... I thought there was, like, last episode, there was such a heartfelt departure. Union didn't even show up at the end. Like, I, I thought it's like, oh, departure, best friends, we'll meet again in the season two. Now nah, she's already back. I'm kind of happy about that, but it's like, the fuck, she's already back? Now, where is this leading to? Is there really some kind of Demon King general related person here? Isn't that technically Chomusuke? We'll see what happens. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.